Hey, welcome to Kitchen Basics 101, where I teach you the bare bone basics as if you have never cooked a day in your life from the perspective of a mom. Just did a candied carrot video, which this comment is coming from, and I was using my mandolin, and a lot of people were making comments about how they've cut themselves or how dangerous a mandolin can be, which I totally agree with. A mandolin can definitely be dangerous if not handled properly. So I ordered from Amazon one of these shoot style mandolins, and I'm just gonna use it while I'm making a potato dish, and I'm gonna give you a little review. A couple of thoughts I have right off the bat is because of the shoot, you're limited to the size of the item. So normally I leave my potatoes whole when I slice them on this mandolin because I'm not limited by size at all. But here in the shoot, I had to cut it in half, which made my slices like this, which is totally fine. They're gonna taste just as delicious, but you lose a little bit of the prettiness factor, but you keep your fingers, so that's good. I'll show you how it works. So it has like a little pusher thing, but I can't get it in there right now because my potato's so big, and there's like a plunger, and you just press down on the potato and hit the plunger, and then you can see it comes out the back here into this little compartment. So I do love that, pros and cons. I have it set on level two for my potatoes, Pros and cons, I do love that it has a little holder to catch. I love that there's no way for me to slice my finger in this situation, but I'm gonna tell you a couple things I don't love. One of the things I don't love is this does fold down for storage. These accessories come off, this foot folds down, but I mean, she's never gonna be as storable as this bad boy, which, you know, it's just facts. This is so slim and store. I also think cleaning, like obviously you have to be careful of this blade when cleaning the mandolin, but this looks like it's going to require some assembly and disassembly every time. So yes, it's a safer option. And if you've ever cut yourself, I definitely think you should pick one of these up. I'm gonna put it in my Amazon store so that you guys can find this particular one. Cause sometimes it's like close, but not quite the same. So it'll be this exact one. Um, but again, I just, you know, Old Faithful is so easy to store, so easy to change the settings. I do love her, I, but I also love her. I mean, let's be honest. Okay, can we get this thing in now? This just feels like this is like, I'm only gonna need it when it gets all the way down to the bottom. Am I crazy? I, I do, I do love this part though, where it's all in this nice little bin. That's nice, okay. I would argue though, if you're using the guard properly, uh, like in this situation, this is essentially like the guard, right? Okay, it did it completely. There is no potato left in the chute. It did it 